A major roadblock for medical marijuana in Ohio may have been solved. Thank you for staying with us at 530. I'm Mike Jackson. I'm Colleen Marshall. The state has been looking for a public university to test marijuana before it's sold in the state, and most major colleges, including Ohio State, have turned them down. But as NBC4's Matt Edwards explains, one small technical college in southeast Ohio is ready to operate a marijuana testing lab. Ohio House Bill 523 requires that an institute of higher learning serve as a lab testing center for medical marijuana in Ohio, and it's found its match right here at Hawking College. I'm very excited because it's, it's really big news, you know what I mean? Big news on this small campus. Hawking College applying to play a large part in Ohio's quest to distribute medical marijuana. It just fits with what we do. We're a hands-on institution. Uh, we're focused on jobs. We don't offer programs here at Hawking College if there's not a job in the end. The school says if the state accepts their application, it will create 12 jobs in this area. The school's job would then be to test samples of medical marijuana grown in Ohio to assure safety and potency. Research that has not been able to happen other places will be able to happen here, and we'll be able to know better the benefits of medical cannabis. Dr. Young telling me the research fits with a new science program they were planning to start next fall and give students an opportunity to work in the growing medical marijuana industry. I feel like a lot of people, um, especially like 10, 20 years ago, wouldn't even imagine this would have been a thing. Just the steps that it's taken to grow and now it's like a snowball. It's like a snowball effect now and it's just rolling and rolling and rolling. As for when medical marijuana will become available through licensed dispensaries in Ohio, the state says it expects the program to be fully operational just about a year from now in September of 2018. At Hawking College tonight, Matt Edwards, NBC4.